Why, hello there, my beautiful earth signs. How are you guys today? <laughs> Thank y'all for tuning into this video. We are doing an elemental reading for your earth signs. And make sure you guys are checking your sun and your moon and your rising, of course. And let's get into it. Let's see what the angels got to say. Okay? So... y'all have had a great week last week let's see what's going on for this week though today's monday july 5th let's see what's going on you guys okay all right at the bottom of the deck we have trust your vibes for a sign y'all need to trust your vibes okay Let's see what's really going on. Let's get some more clarity for these earth signs. Okay. All right. So you guys are all in the reverse. So very important messages here. So, okay. This, this is a really interesting reading. So <clears throat> we got loved one in heaven. So, uh, y'all got some, I think these earth signs, whoever's watching this, you guys have some powerful ancestors. I'm feeling that vibe right now. Y'all got some powerful ancestors. <laughs> and maybe they've been telling y'all you need to trust yourself a little more on um, some situations that have been going on, okay? You guys also have Archangel Ragel, which is peace in harmony, okay? You're searching for that inner peace. You're trying to align yourself with that inner peace. We gonna see how you gonna get there. Because we all know it's a journey to get to inner peace. <laughs> <laughs> and you guys also have, excuse me, hold up, let me just boop, boopity scoop, okay. And you guys also have healthy choices, okay? So, the overall message I'm getting here is that you guys have some ancestors and some people that love you, your spirit guides, people that are up there, out in the spirit realm, and they're just telling you, like, you know, you want to align yourself with that inner peace and you're really, you're on that quest. Maybe some of you have been feeling a lot more peaceful lately and you have been trusting your vibes a lot more lately, which is great. But for some of you who have been um, trying to do that, this is your sign that you, that it's time to really start focusing on that inner peace of yours and doing the things that bring you peace and bring you happiness whether that be you know <laughs> making healthier choices that doesn't mean just um the things that you eat it also means the things that you are consuming as far as social media goes as far as your energy goes just period energy overall what are you consuming and the relationships that you have with people there might be some people that are just not healthy for you and it's about that time that they gotta go and maybe <laughs> your ancestors have been telling you like this person is not good for you and they gotta go they're not bringing you peace there's a person and and that's a like one of the stronger messages that i'm getting it's like there are some people around you that don't want to see you win and they're not healthy for you and whether you know it or not or you're uh choosing to ignore it or not <laughs> um these people gotta go and you need to trust how you feel about people and situations okay because it's like you need to do what's best for you and your inner self and your inner peace and there may be some people who are like hating on the low giving you that evil eye energy you need to protect yourself you need to make healthier choices and who and what type of situations you allow in your life right like and y'all know ancestors don't play your spirit guides don't play your angels don't play okay and if you need help with um like when it comes to 
maybe you want to confront somebody and you're like wondering if you need to cut them off and you're like should I just cut them off or should I talk to them whether whatever it may be Archangel Raguel, he's the one to help you with that because he is the angel of peaceful resolution. He will help you bring any conflict or any type of situation that involves like conflict or problems or things you don't want to be involved in. He will help you bring it to a peaceful conclusion that is like beneficial for you especially, but for all parties involved. So it's like no harm is done type energy, you know? So connect with him he's obviously trying to connect with you so connect with him and you know i'm sure he's in contact with your spirit guides and with your ancestors too and they're all up there conspiring like look we need to get this person together like we need to get them together because they over here just trying to allow anybody and everybody up in the energy <laughs> or if that's not you and you're already cutting people off like there you go good that's how you're gonna get that inner peace <laughs> so just trust your vibes and just really like trust yourself in your intuition and knowing like who and what is good for you like what you eat what you're looking at on social media like there is so many toxic like things on social media like filter out what you consume like go on your social media if you have to and unfollow a bunch of those pages that are just like drama and like celebrities and like this and that like put some upliftness stuff on your timeline okay all right now let's see what the romance angels have to say let's say see if they can uh, add on or clarify anything for you guys <laughs> let's see romance angels what's going on with these earth signs let's get some clarity here okay get some ooh, ooh. Okay, all right, I see you. I see you, no worries. Oh, shit. Excuse my language. <laughs> okay. Oh, that's interesting. Ooh. Oh, that's interesting. So remember how we were talking about, like, people who may not be in your best interest and that are kind of, like, you know, trying to stick around and throw your vibe off and stuff? Okay, so look. Honey, honey, what is this? Release your ex. What is this? <laughs> some of y'all got an ex. Not everybody, but some of y'all. Y'all got an ex that is still trying to linger and trying to make themselves relevant in your life. And it ain't it. This person, so I got two other cards too. You also got new love and this could be the one okay so look i'm gonna do it like this so okay release your ex this has to do with this with what your your angels and your ancestors are telling you like you got to get rid of some people this people is one of them people they gotta go <laughs> like this ex ain't good for you like and maybe you have to keep in contact with him whether with them whether it be for kids or like whatever it may be like sometimes i get it like you have to keep in contact with them but don't you know get hung up on them they you know it, look how stressed out this person looks like oh my gosh like dang get out <laughs> it looks stressed out like that's what i'm feeling and it's like you know you got your spiritual team is like stop like let, let it be let it go because you're where you you need to focus on you and your inner peace okay like this is about you right now you're at a moment in your life where this is about you <laughs> and you coming to terms with who you are and what brings you fulfillment we ain't worried about all them other people that are bringing extra problems and stuff like that's not that's not the move so but for some of you who are welcoming in that new love, okay, this person might be it for you. So once you release that ex, and you know what? It may not even be just an ex. This could be an ex-friend, an ex, uh, 
just somebody who was close to you like even a family member that was close to you at one point and now they're like your ex kind of like situation like now y'all ain't close no more people like basically all this is saying is that people are trying to come back that were aren't good for you and you have other people who are more aligned with you and aligned with your spirit and aligned with your you know your purpose and they're going to support you and your journey to inner peace and these are the people that they want you to align with so you need to be focused more on these type of people so and it's not even that you're focused on these type of people it's more like you're focused on yourself and aligning with your inner peace making them healthy choices trusting your intuition and those people are just going to naturally come to you like it's not even going to be an issue like you won't even have to go searching for anybody you know what i'm saying like it's like how they say focus on yourself and the right people will come to you that's it that's it right there so this person gotta go or people <laughs> these people gotta go your ancestors and your angels said so and you're gonna be making room for more blessings whether that be in the form of people or situations or opportunities and they're all coming to you so okay guys my earth signs my lovely earth signs that was for you um that's the week ahead what it's looking like so i hope you enjoyed this video and i'll see you guys in the next one okay